Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the face lock. Today, Brock's gym. Indeed. Uh, let's make sure we have shit. Lex is at number one. It's where he's supposed to be because he's fucking Lex. It's gonna be a pushover, man. I'm telling you right now. Because Lex Luthor with a bubble doesn't fuck around. No fucks given. No fucking around necessary. I'll tell you that much. But Diglett's fast. So if he gets off a move on me, that's gonna be bad. <laughs> Scratch. Ow. Okay, that's fine. Bubble will kill him, hopefully. Oh, shit. Apparently not. That's not good. Bubble will kill him. Right? Okay. Right. Bubble is like doing nothing to him. I didn't even realize Bubble lowered speed. That's weird. Uh, maybe I should, uh, maybe should have leveled Lex up a bit more. Zod wasn't really necessary to be leveled up, but, uh, no. I can kill Sand True enough easily. I hope. Critical. That was a crit, really? Okay. 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 Wow, I'm can Really, you're gonna keep making me miss? This is pretty bullshit. Really? Okay. Okay, right, maybe we should switch out here. Uh, we don't want Lex to die. Let's go to... Uh... We'll go to Zod. Zod can do this. And we'll potion... Fuck you. I have keen eye, bitch! Die. God damn it. Why do abilities not exist in this gen? Alright, we're gonna potion up Lex. And then we'll switch him back in. Yes, yeah, sand attack. I get it, you fucking douchebag. Switch back to Lex. Yes, okay. Do, 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 do. High disc usage by Camtasia Recorder. No shit, Sherlock. No fucking shit. Okay, there we go. Come on. Come on! It's doing that little amount of HP damage? Come on. It's disappointing me. Maybe I should have leveled up a bit more. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't go up against Brock, seeing as I had such a hard time against that guy, and Brock has shit that's even worse. Though the Onyx is four times weak to water, so that helps. Um, I might do a little bit of training with Lex, and we'll see how, uh, how that goes. Uh, we might as well heal ourselves up at the Pokemon Center, though, first of all. Okay. Ugh. What is wrong with my cold this weekend? I don't know, man. Just too much coldness. Uh, yes, okay. Level 12. Okay, that was a bad battle. Okay. 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 And let's go to the Pokemon Center. Heal up. Super speed. Okay, I healed like seven times, but that's fine. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm level 12. Maybe I should go for level 13. I don't know. Maybe overkill. But whatever. I don't give a fuck. Okay. Uh, oh, shit. Oh, don't run away. Ah! Shit. <laughs> I'm failing so hard right now. Okay. Oh, crap. Go the... Down the fucking... No, no. <laughs> no. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Shit. Okay. okay. I thought I'd frozen it there for a second. Fuck. Whew! Alright, I'm just, I'm going a bit crazy here. Off the rails. Come on, Lex. Level up already. Fuck. God damn it. I know you're level 12 and shit, but level up already. Hurry up! Viewers are getting impatient here! God damn it. Okay, fuck. I keep freezing the game almost. Maybe I should, uh, lay off a bit on the fucking... There we go! Okay, level 13. That'll do me. Sorry, I should have done that off screen, but... You can blame yourselves for, I don't know, no reason. Anyway, let's go back to the gym. I really should edit the speed option so that it doesn't go that fast. Because that is like criminally fast. That amount of speed is pretty crazy. I don't even, I don't even. So let's go here. Oh dear, hi Brock. Maybe we should save before. No, that's, that's fucking pussy's way out. Let's, uh. Let's have a look at my Pokemons, yeah. Lex, okay, right. We can use Davis' death fodder if things go shitty, but hopefully it won't. I'm Brock Pura Studies. I believe in rock and hard defense and determination. I'm also Irish. I'm rock hard and I know got solid skills. 
Dark Matter on rocks. Really? Someone's gonna be ringing me right now. Okay. Well, I guess we'll pause and we'll continue in a second. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where my recording screwed up. Again, for the second time, it's okay, though, because I'm here with Post Narration Z to, to fill in all your woes and, and to, to tell you that everything's gonna be okay, because our little thing is gonna be alright. Do 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 do. Yeah, so, uh, I did have some fuck ups if you didn't notice in episode 3. Um, that was bad, because I lost the face cam for like most of the video. And then, like, half of this video, Facecam got lost because you can blame my sister for calling me on the phone, so... I don't know. Something like bad things and stuff, so... Hmm. We're making um, some good, heavy uh, use of Lex here, though. Lex is doing well against Brock. He he doesn't need no uh, backup crew, because uh, he's got this on lockdown, man. Freaking Onyx doesn't have nothing to take me down with. Um, I got a little bit scared to cause Screech, and I knew I wasn't going to kill him with one bubble, and I was kind of scared, but then obviously I got the speed drop from bubble, so I wasn't scared anymore, because I could just outspeed him and kill him on the next turn, which I do, and uh, now I get a nice level 14 level up! Oh, what do you know about leveling up to 14? Nothing! I tell you that much free, nothing! I know about the leveling up, and you don't, and... Mmm! That's what I'm doing, the LP, and you're not! La 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 la! I'm, of course, taking the piss, because anyone can beat Brock, he is not very difficult. One thing, he doesn't even wear a t-shirt, and for another thing, he, do he doesn't even show us his body, he just covers himself up. You don't know what could be under there, it could be like a tattoo of a Geodude, it could be like some tattoo of I love Nurse Joy and Officer Jenny, who knows? Frickin' Brock, man, he just does what he likes. He kind of looks like Goku in that sprite, uh, pointy out Super Saiyan hair. Uh, kind of does, interestingly enough. I don't know why. Um, but hey, that's what happens. So, we killed him, we murdered him, defeated him, destroyed him, destroyed, demolished, you know, all the good stuff. And, uh, I can't even remember what I do in the rest of this episode. I think I just piss around. Oh, that's what I do. I see the pewter museum. I'm like, maybe I should actually go to the museum for once, because I, I don't remember the last time I went and played Blue and went in the museum. To be honest, I perfectly can't even remember the first last time I played this game through, like, fully. Uh, I'm not even sure if I have played it through since I first played it, which is weird as hell. Uh, Gold and Silver and Crystal, I played through all three of those. So I've been through that game three times when I was younger, at least. Uh, I don't think I've played it recently, but I did play through Heart Gold, so... You know, I've played through a significant amount of the second generation games. Mainly because they were my favourite generation. Obviously, I owned all three games. Mm. And everyone, well, most people, most people my age anyway, will consider Gen 2 the, the peak of the series. Um, I don't know, it was just where my height of Pokemon obsession was uh, it's, uh, at its maximum. And the games really hit their stride in the second gen. Freaking, like, everything was so much smoother. Mm. So much better, so much more you know, refined, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure how many of my audience members would uh, would have been around for second gen. Um, I don't know how many of you played second gen when it came out, but second gen was the shit, man. Loads of, loads of good stuff. Um, I'm getting bored in this museum, but I'm, in the original narration of this, I was pissed off because I had to pay a whole 50 freaking poker dollars to walk around in this place, which has a couple of rocks, and a space shuttle, which doesn't even mean anything in this game. Like, it may have meant something in 3rd gen, where they have that one island with the rocket ship, but no, it doesn't even make any difference here. It's something to do with Clefairies coming from the moon, I don't know. I don't even know the lore. There's like some lore about, I don't even know, Clefairies coming from the moon and farting in their sleep. I don't have a clue what I'm talking about now. Mmm. I'm just drinking and sipping and, I know, generally pissed off. This footage just doesn't convey what I was actually saying at the time, because I was wandering around the museum. I was like, fine, I'm just going to walk around the museum. I'm going to get my 50 bucks worth. I'm just I'm just going to spend as much time in here as I jolly well like. And I'm just going to walk into walls and everything, because that's how I roll. But um, obviously, clearly, at some point, I have to leave, because it's pretty useless, that museum. Nothing too interesting. Oh, there's a cuttable branch. Um, 
Which I need cut for, obviously. I don't have cut. So, hey, what am I going to do about that? Nothing. I'm going to have to wait until I get the HM and then come back here. Even if I wanted to come back here, it would take some time. So I could probably... Wouldn't even be bothered to do so, but whatever. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Um, I don't think I make any more progress in this video, so be ready to just not make progress. I realise that I haven't been making progress a lot in these videos, and people were like, Man, you're going slower than Spade in his LP, and I'm like, yeah, I probably am, but that's because I don't want things to die. This is a Nuzlocke, remember, so... Uh, I don't want to be too rash about it, but um, yeah, I'm going to pretty much save in front of this girl, and that's going to be the episode. But next time, we'll make some more progress, kill some people, and have fun. I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.